saves your hair, prevents breakage and damage. Um, it's cheap, inexpensive. It's it's it's, it's it nourishes your hair. It's perfect. It's good. It's it saves time. Yeah, it saves time. It's easy to make. It doesn't require much. You know, you know, it's good, 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 perfect, good, everything I want. And it's just one ingredient. Just one. All you need is just that one ingredient. And you can make a perfect detangler that your hair is going to love. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new yet, you're so welcome. And if not, if you're a subscriber, thank you for subscribing. Thank you for coming back to watch another video. And if you've not subscribed, I implore you like subscribe um turn on the notification bell so you can always get notified each time i post new videos and um just drop a comment down below you know for videos you like to see video suggestions um questions anything anything and i am going to drop um links to my other videos in the description box so you can just check it out so as you all can see by the title today's video is about my favorite detangler I mean, it is it is my favorite because it has a lot of um, properties, and I have a lot of reasons why I use it. I am just going to state them out for you, so you can see how good it is. So first, it saves your hair, prevents breakage and damage. Um, it's cheap, inexpensive. It's it's it's, it's it nourishes your hair. It's perfect. It's good. It's it saves time. Yeah, it saves time, it's easy to make, it doesn't require much. You know, you know, it's good, 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 perfect, good, everything I want. And it's just one ingredient. Just one. All you need is just that one ingredient. And you can make a perfect detangler that your hair is going to love. So, um, <clears throat> I have a story to tell. I have a story to tell. So, um, okay, before I unleash it, my on Saturday... I accidentally tangled my hair. Bye. Okay, I, I, I really don't know how it got tangled. But what I what happened was my hair was there and I there was something I do which is I spritz my hair with um water. So um I just sat down on Saturday, there was nothing I was doing and I just started spraying water on my hair continuously. I think I did it for about I did it like more than 10 times, you know, just continuously, and then I decided to put my hair in twists. Nobody sent me. I decided to put my hair in twists, and when I did, so I unraveled it because I was trying to, you know, practice something. And then when I unraveled it, I left it. So I think the reason why my hair got tangled was because I, after I unraveled it, you know, the twists, I got to be, you know, single bonds everywhere, everywhere, everywhere. I slept on the bed, like I rested my hair on the bed, which is something I don't do because, you know, shrinkage, that's why I don't do it. So I did it, and I didn't just rest on the place, I just rested all over, all over, all over. I moved, and I kept moving, kept moving my hair, and my head on the bed. And then before I knew what was happening, it got tangled. Yeah, I tangled it. And it was, like, my hair is soft, yeah, but then it just, it didn't get hard, but it just got stubborn, just got stiff. I was trying to finger the tangle, you know, just try to make things better, to ease everything, everything, but nothing was working. So I, I wasn't going to leave it like that, because I did not want to leave it like that, because I knew that I didn't have time to leave it like that, because of the time that I was going to, you know, consume if I had left it like that. So I managed to finger the tangle it, and I put it in twists, just, you know, twists, um, Nothing much, nothing special. So since then, since Saturday, I didn't add anything to it. No water, no um, no moisturizer. I just left it like that because I didn't have time for it. I was so busy doing nothing, by the way. So, okay. So on the count of three, I am going to unravel it. So prepare to be amazed. But note, you cannot shame the shameless. I am not ashamed in my game. Alright, so, <clears throat> on the count of three, I am going to unravel it. You know, so, one, oh god, two, three. Yeah, yeah, this is it. You know, I, I probably look like Medusa right now, but I don't care. I really do not care. 
all right so this is it and everything is just tangled even the twists are tangled you know the strands and the twists are tangled the twist itself is quite tangled see i can't quite get it too okay okay yeah yeah so yeah done it so i'm just going to go ahead and unravel everything and then i go until showing you how i make my detangler why do I want to explain everything from the beginning again? I mean, I, I, I so love this aloe vera detangler. I mean, it's perfect, you know. And, okay, I'm going to skip off that. No, 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 no. I am ashamed to say any of it, so I'm going to skip it. Okay, so I'm just going to go ahead to unravel the twists. See? My hair is locked. See? It is locked. Okay, so I'm just going to... Um, unravel the twists, and I'm going to be careful because when I was um, finger detangling it, I I broke some strands. Yeah, they kept breaking, and I noticed it. And I didn't even try to do anything about it because I was just tired, and I didn't want to leave my hair like that. So I just, you know, I was I was I wasn't angry, but I just wanted to get it off and you know just do like that. But then I discovered I was breaking too much. Than I could undo, so I just left it and I just twisted everything in yam in yam. So I'll just keep um, unraveling it. First, it is dirty. My hair right now is dirty because I actually have um, build off from something I used. I made it. It's actually I call it a cocktail, but it's an oil. I mean, it's a combination of a lot of not oils. It's not a combination of oils. It's a combination of um, a lot of um, natural, you know, products. I am not going to mention it, but I'm going to. Um, very soon, I am going to drop the video. So it. The reason why I used it was I damaged my edges unintentionally. I, I didn't know how I got damaged because I was doing everything right. I, you know, I, I did mostly the things I preach, um, not pulling the edges tight, not snatching the edges all the time, not, you know, laying your edges all the time, blah, 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 blah. I did everything. But still, my this particular side of my hair, I don't know if you can notice the difference. See? Yeah, it's fully grown. But this side is short was actually almost bald but then I used it and I, I just don't know I had little bumps and medium bumps everywhere on this part of my edges and even when okay no I had bumps there and my hair couldn't grow even the hair that was there started coming off so that that was the main reason why I, you know continue to spray water on my hair all the time which actually led to it getting tangled everywhere oh god I look like hmm. Alright, so I'm just going to show you what I mean. So my hair is dirty. The product, I call it a cocktail, is actually a leave-in, um, you know, DIY. I did it myself. It's, it's, you leave it in. It's a um, leave-in stuff. Build up from it. My hair is actually low porosity, so that means nothing goes in easily. The, um, no matter how light the oil is, it stays there, you know, and it stays for a very long time, like, you know, I, I really don't know how porosity hair works because I have low porosity hair. But my hair, no matter the kind of oil you put, no matter how light it is, no ma even if it is water, the lightest of all, even 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 water stays for a very long time on my hair. I'm going to show you how I make my detangler. It's, you know, you're going to see the magic when... I, okay, okay, you know what? I'm going to make it on camera. And I'm going to, you know, apply it to my hair right on camera. And just stay here, don't go nowhere, and let's get to it. These are my aloe vera leaves, and I grew them myself because it's quite difficult to get aloe vera around here. So, um, as little as they are, they still have some gel in them, and you know, we're here for the goodness. So, um, I, I actually laid them down like this, and I have cut the ends to get this yellow um yellowish stuff 
out of them because it's bad for your hair and it's i i kind of react to it when any bit of it gets onto my hair so you see it's a little bit um slimy and i'm just going to you know i have my knife here and with the knife i'm going to scrape the edges the edges are quite sharp and you know they could be dangerous and we don't even need them anyways so I'm going to cut everything off carefully and I'm going to try to save as much aloe vera as I can so just um, watch me do it so right now with a spoon I'm going to scoop out the gel from the leaves and I am going to try to get as much gel as I can from the leaves and yeah that's just what I'm doing here so um as you can see i have gotten everything out and i'm just going to take it to the blender for it to blend and when you want to blend with the blender make sure you use just the inch you know the inch blend um label okay everyone so um yeah this is everything right here you know um you're probably thinking it's little but it's amazing what a little stuff can do and this used to be the um spray bottle for a i don't quite remember but yeah then i recycled it so to say and yeah so i have a detangling comb my detangling comb right here and just watch me what my magic so I'm just yeah you you can probably notice this um on my hair i actually rubbed some of the leaves onto my hair when i was making the gel you know goodness can't go to waste so i'm just going to spray it onto my hair and i'm going to massage it onto my hair So as you can see, I am done. I'm done with everything. And as you can see, the one tangled hair has been made better. So it's a brilliant tangled and um it's just so good. And it's what I'm talking about. I really don't like the way it feels on my skin when it drips. So that is actually one of the reasons why I don't use um a lot of gel because when it's too much it drips and I it's the feel of that. So um I really don't know what it looks like at the back. I'm going to have to show you how it's at the back. And my hair shrinks a lot my hair shrinks a lot and i think it's normal and i like it i love it like that and just just look at the way my finger just goes through it you know see don't have to you know slow down or anything my finger just goes smooth and i actually didn't break any hair i know that i'm like the last time i tried to finger the tangle in east i actually broke a lot of strands see it's it's dripping and i don't like it so um this is it and yeah i'm done so i'm just going to go ahead and wash it um, no before i wash it off i'm going to leave it for you know um 20 to 30 minutes so it can just do its work you know do its thing i'm, I'm gonna leave it for 30 minutes you know, i have some things to do so i'm just going to run around and do everything and it's going to continue doing its work so um after that i'm going to go ahead and wash it off with my favorite shampoo um, if you want to see that, if you want to see how I do that, you know, the way I do it, the procedures, you can just comment down below, you know, ask for it, and I'm going to give you art. Okay, so that's everything, that's all, and don't forget to like, subscribe, comment down below, and check out my um, videos. I'm going to put the link, I'm going to drop the links in the description box. See you next time. Bye-bye.